In today's video, I'll be showing you what I will be doing with this grow bed here behind me. Here you can see these three grow beds that I had originally. This one I'm changing. I had it to grow fairies moss. I still want to set something up to grow, grow fairies moss and duckweed, but right now I'm going to change it into a constant height grow bed. So basically, it will be kind of like kind of like this one um, at the moment this is constant height where it just water comes in and exits from here but this is a, supposed to be a bell siphon just need to put it back in there this one I'll turn into a constant height so the water will stay at one level and go out through this pipe down into this tank right here so it used to before have a tube going from here directly into the sump but I'm trying to make everything cleaner so those two pipes will disappear and basically this pipe from here will go into there but this will be turned into a constant height media grow bed so I'll put hydroton in here and then I'll put all this watercress so I'll basically take that watercress there and all this watercress and stick it in there so that that one would stay there so almost ready to put the hydroton in I just gotta clean the bottom so I got this part set up so this is where the water will come in it will go in and enter at the bottom I will make this, there's a hole right here, I'm going to try to make that bigger and put a, whatever you call it on there to add air so their air gets in the bottom and I might put a pipe going along the bottom that I can stick up and if I needed to blow air into it I can do that as well. And then here's where the water exits. For the bottom of this grow bed I basically made this grid with a bunch of holes at the bottom. So that will either be for later when I want to put air underneath here or have it connected to here connected to here and put water but as of now it's just going to sit there and then the water will be coming in through here to this spot right here and going all the way to the bottom that way when the because this is going to be a constant height grow bed and it's just going to overflow from over here and then go down there so I'm going to have the water go in at the bottom and then have to come up. So that is how that will be. I have it all set and ready to add the hydroton. So I have this all squared away. I have the grid at the bottom. Then I have this mesh basket right here. So this is where the water will overflow. I'll probably have to make a cover for this. And then I have the pipe that goes down to the tank over there. So that is how that looks. Now I'll add some hydroton. I have this grow bed pretty much squared away. I just need to have a cover over this spot. That was my turkey so that algae doesn't grow in here. But you can see I have the hydroton in here. Then it's constant overflow so it goes from here down to there. So what I will do is actually I'm going to transplant all this watercress from these two grow beds into here and that will be my watercress grow bed. So I'm going to do that right now. I was going to plant all of this, but I decided not to. So here you can see this is, I guess you can say, my first watercress harvest, which is pretty cool. I pretty much overgrew this grow bed you saw earlier. So I planted this, these few here, which will do good. So that is how it, it will be now, and then those will take off. Hopefully this one comes back. When I was taking the watercress out, it kind of pulled that out, but 
that I would say is a good first harvest for watercress. Here you can see the watercress setup you just saw in this video. It is overgrown now, which is pretty cool. It's nice to see that the plants are doing good. If you want something easy to grow, you can grow watercress. It's also very healthy, but it grows like a weed, you can say. So this whole grow bed right here is filled with watercress. But you can see that's how it is. It does grow pretty quickly. I'm not sure how long it's been since I did that. Maybe a month. But it is nice to see plants growing. Since I don't have much at the moment, I'm still doing setting up stuff and have other things going on.